Okay, we're back with something interesting. Another dead end, but it's the newest legend size version. From Rising Force, this is Catfish. I'm not kidding, that is legit his name. I want to talk about this is a nice box. Simple and easy. You got a bit of a picture of why of the guy in the front. So I think Chinese, it's Mandarin, there. And that's pretty much it. Got the name on the side, his at, I think for Weibo, the name of the company he's doing, and some choke cans, nothing on the back. Simple and easy, that's what you want. So back to this. I did a bit of research on this company. Supposedly this guy was supposed to be masterpiece scaled, but then the guy decided to make them legend sized. I can't complain, I like much more. Cause these guys do the scramble city thing. Where this guy can be an arm or a leg. I like that very much. Because the last combiner, third party combiner I know that did that was Fans Project. And I do believe, if rumors are true, New Age is going to do it. Anyway, back to this guy. So he's very nice. A few problems here and there. Because this is their first release. And Stuff. Yeah, a few loose joints here and there. Some interesting design choices for joints. But hey, it, it looks good. Very G1. So, head ball jointed. And yet, that couldn't look up. No looking down. Arms are ball jointed, so full 360 in and out. Bit of a butterfly joint. In the arms and the instrument part, there's a ball joint before a hinge, which interests me a lot. Could have been just a swivel, but hey. And our hands are ball jointed. There is waist. And you can get a ab crunch if you extend it and swivel around the joint for that, so you can get an ab crunch. But that's for combination. Anyway. Our legs. Bit of a there. Forward, back, in and out, swivel, good knee, and a pivot on the foot. So yeah, it's really good posable for something small. Kinda wish I got the ma magic square guy out, but mm, I can't get to him. He's been hidden behind two others. <laughs> well, three other fast commanders. So, transformation for car mode, simple and easy. Also, he has a very nice gun. So we will do the legs first. So right here, the panel you want to flip open, like so. So you can flip everything out. And you want to have nails for when you're flipping the wheels out. And a flathead screwdriver when you're getting from vehicle to rubber, because these legs feet, you fold in, and there's not real much where they pull them out without getting a flathead screw on it, feeding it in and pull, pushing it out. Now we will rotate right, and rotate the waist, the leg up, and put the pound back over. So yeah, that's, pretty, that's a good idea. I like the fake wheel you get there, make it look nice. Okay. Yeah, keep it extended for now, so we can do this top section, which is pretty simple. Rotate the hand around, flip them away, rotate the which so the when the side mirror is facing out and pretty much collapse them up. Oh, before you forget. Come in here there's a side the little panel you have to flip out. And just push the arms in and the hood will come down. Now we can just peg everything together. Make everything short, everything is lined. Oh. And there he is, and his car mode, which is very nice.
kind of wish there was a stripe on there, but still good. And the hole there, you can put the gun. It's not the best, but it holds right now. So yeah, very nice. Now we'll take the gun off. So the, it doesn't show the pictures for combination modes in the constructions, but I've seen pictures online of the pre-order pages. It's pretty much for leg mode, it's pretty simple. It's hard to miss this. Put them like this, then you get the hood and just push it down. That's leg mode for him. Pretty simple. And for arm mode, push the hood back up and extend it. And orient, orientate the arm, the leg, so that you get the ball joint facing outwards. So there's your elbow. And we don't get any conclusions because that's going to come with Mode Master. And that's his arm mode. Very nice. You can put the gun back in there, but <laughs> it's not the best. So yeah, I would get this, just have something different, because we have the magic square guy. That's the only other legend combiner we have for Mensaur. Until New Age finally decides to release this, I'm waiting still. But yeah, I recommend getting these guys, just have a little interesting thing. Also, the Scramble City thing is so good, because you got like, quite a different number of combinations there, which is going to be good. So I'll see you for the last video of the year. And it's going to be a good one. Bye.